Hello, hello, crafty peeps. Welcome back to my channel, Crafty Ish Kristen. Today, this chaotic mess is going to be tamed, and we are going to be kitting up this adorable painting, Cheer Bear with Stars by Regan Kubitschek from Art and Soul Diamonds. It is a 55 by 80 centimeter square kit. They are resin diamonds. And let's get into it. I do not need the, what you call it? Oh, inventory sheet. I have dryer sheets just in case, but these didn't look like they had static. Famous last words, I know. So I hope everybody is doing well before I forget to ask, because I will forget. So I am just cutting off these first numbers because I do not use them because I diamond paint by symbol and if I have extra things, it just confuses me. And I have a helper already. Hello, Duncan. Fancy seeing you on the dining room table. I will show you the canvas as well. Um, you know, once I move some of my piles of crap. <laughs> because, yeah. All right. Watch out, kitty cat. Don't be getting in the way of my scissors. So, Munchie put in Trashy Catty, my my trash can cat. Had a little, had a little accident, and his hat, um, yeah, his hat kind of came off and ripped. So it's just casually resting on his head. I'm gonna put this aside, put it over there for my log book. So here are these. This is mess. You are literally on the place that I need to move stuff around on. So, not helping. Not helping, little boop boop. We are going to be using Elizabeth Wards because I found some of my Elizabeth Wards and I emptied some because I finished some kits. So, pardon me. Excuse me. Pardon. Um, excuse me. You're, you're making a mess. Uh, so, quickly show you the canvas. If you don't remember or you didn't see the unboxing, super freaking cute. My gosh, look at it, even has the little Care Bear heart on his, her, her butt. Sorry, didn't mean to misgender you, Cheer Bear. But I think this is going to look so amazing. I mean, I'm not a rendering expert by any means, uh, but yeah. I am way more excited than I probably be, should be for a diamond painting. Uh, so, as you can see, um, I have some Elizabeth Wards. <laughs> yeah. I did at one point, I think I purchased four trays total. And I think I purchased two of the maybe three of the ones that have, you know, the different sizes. And then I know I purchased at least one with just the little containers because I feel like those are the most versatile because like in theory, if I have a giant bag, I can just put them in multiple little containers. Whereas with the other sizes, you kind of play that guessing game because you don't know what size is this going to fit in. At least I do. I'm horrible at gauging whether or not they will fit. I'm sorry, Munchie, Puddin, Trashy Caddy, but your hat might need to be retired. So this is a Bella Art De Nicole tray. It's one of their new, I can't remember if it's called like Mermaid Shift or something. I don't know, but it's pink and purple. And I figure it is right on point for what we're doing. And then I also have a Bijou Bliss tray right there. Okay. It has been a hot minute since I've used Elizabeth Ward. So I'm trying to remember the best way to do this. Oh, I shouldn't have cut those off. Well, that was really freaking stupid. <sighs> because they have, oh, here, never mind. Nope, I'm not stupid. Um, because these only have the numbers on them, not the DMC numbers. See, don't be like me. Learn from my mistakes, guys. 
So number 15 is 520. So let's find Mr. 520. I'm pretty sure he is going to fit in a little container. But mm, normally I don't put the stickers on this early. I make sure it fits but I'm a little worried that I may not remember. So, and I don't know if these stickers come off nicely or not. Oh, you can't see what I'm doing. I am I so, I swear my chair is not tucked into the table properly and I'm a mess. It's been, it's been a week, man. Okay, those all fit. Let's take Mr. Lid off and put you over there. This might be too big of a tray, realistically. So we have our first. And I just put them in the tray wherever. And then I will reorganize them. When? Can you not eat the... Seriously, my cat's trying to eat this. I cannot with you people. I need you people to function. Can you cats function? I don't feel like it's too much to ask. I really don't. So I will just put these in here haphazardly. And then when all is said and done, then we will put them away nicely. There's no point in me trying to organize them right now. Because it's not going to work. I am far too chaotic and unorganized to have it all in order. Oh my gosh, see, look at that. I'm already, I'm already spilling, but I did, well, no. I don't wanna, I don't wanna jinx myself and say the, the dreaded S word. You know which word. Stop! It's gonna be one of those kidding ups, isn't it? Great. The S word. The static. I did not really see any. Why did I do that? That was really dumb because I should have taken the sticker. Um, Munchie, I'm sorry. I had to break you open because I don't know which. Ah. He was number five. Number five. Ooh. Okay. Number five. Number five is 321. Let's just go ahead and put the stickers directly on the container. And if we have to take them off, we have to take them off. <laughs> Otherwise, we're going to be here all day. And while I don't mind, I have nothing else I need to do for the next two hours. Uh, you guys might have actual important stuff to do. So 42, that should fit in a small one. Okay, why is this? Why do I feel like I'm sitting so far away? So number 42, don't throw the bag away yet. Don't throw the bag away. Oh, oh Elizabeth Ward, why must you be like that? Playing a game of chicken. Okay, 42. Now I'm like, I don't know, maybe I don't want to put the stickers on because since I can't gauge if they're going to fit or not, don't waste the diamonds. These diamonds look really good. They are very, very square, which is what you want in a square diamond kit, <laughs> right? 42, okay, we have 40. What is wrong? 3716. Three, seven, one, six. Here we go. There we go. Put you right there. There's that. Okay. I had to rearrange things because things are not working for me right now. Okay. That is a loose diamond. I don't know what color it is. It's going over there. Next. Let's do number 16. Would it be helpful if I put these in order? Probably. Am I going to? No. So we have number 16 is 602. Let's put this on our thing. Oh, wow. So I'm really bad at cleaning my stickers off. Uh, I just realized I have ones that are 
on the sides of the Elizabeth Wards. This was either from St Clematis Stained Glass or Gethsemane, uh, because I think those are the only two kits that I've had in Elizabeth Wards where I actually had to turn some of them on their side in order for them all to fit in one tray because there were too many containers. And now my cat is meowing. I apologize if it gets your cats all jazzed up, but he's mad because dad went downstairs. So he's just gonna sit by the door and meow. 34 is the star and it is 936. 936, 936. Here we go. This tray is so pretty. Oh my gosh. Uh oh. Now we're in trouble. Oh, see? <gasps> Can you say hi? You can just say a quick hello. Hello. There you go. Good job. Nice and nice and nice and brisk to the point. Uh, the one cat's meowing. Cause, cause you left him. Oh, I left you. I know. Poor thing. Such neglected animals. No. I'm trying to find small bags that I know will fit in the little ones before I, I venture into bigger to bigger ones. This could take a really long time. If only I had help. <sighs> it's fine. See, I don't understand this. I know you don't understand. See, these ones are even trickier to load, so you probably wouldn't be skilled enough to put diamonds in these containers. Mm -mm. I mean, you could come over here and try to prove me wrong, but. No, I already know. Just... You're fine. So, we have... oh, look at that. We have six done. Hey, six out of 58. Yes, but it has lots of colors. So it's going to be extra magical. 3363. So it's going to be extra magic. When you have Care Bears, how can it not be magical? Okay, I probably should have trimmed these stickers better. Because that is really long. Okay, why did I just put it in the exact stupid place that I had it before? Oh, get it together. So, yeah, they're a little long. I probably should trim them. Let's just do that while I'm saying it so I don't... Because I don't need all that extra right there on the end part of those. So, get out of here. And... Don't cut yourself, don't cut yourself, don't cut yourself. Don't. Oh, almost cut that number off. Oh my gosh. That'd have been bad. There's that. Go over there. And then this one. All right. Then it won't be so much overhang. Do, 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 do. There we go. Okay. There we go. Now it's gonna go smoothly. Oh, come on. Don't, don't not fit. I already put the sticker on. I love how these look, but I always feel like using the Elizabeth Wards is more stressful in the kitting up process. Cause I'm always feel like I'm playing that will it fit or won't it fit game. Okay, let's hide this from the cat. Oh, here we go, we have 310. Let's see, this one, that one, maybe not that one. And I did mention in my unboxing, I did get a, um, <laughs> a pack of round 
fairy, not fairy dust, uh, soul dust. Uh, so, but they are going to send me the proper ones. So that's nice. You know, things happen. <laughs> so, I like to say that, you know, like all companies, they have hiccups, snafus, whatever you want to call them. Uh, what matters is how they react when you say, uh, hey, I have a problem. So, I mean, I literally, I sent a message and I got a response in five minutes. So, fantastic. And I mean, granted, for small businesses, you know, I always tend to give people grace anyways, just because you don't have a giant army of people who are there 24 hours a day, you know, just waiting for that, that email or that call. Uh, so small businesses are, are working 24 seven. So yay, 38, 38, 38, 38, 966, the little one, I got 966, there we go. Okay. Oh yeah, that fits so much nicer when I cut off that extra. Now it's going to bug me that all those you know, that are already in the tray have the extra, but I'll just try not to make eye contact with them. Come on. Oh, that wasn't very smart. Now was it? Just put them in the tray. And so I have never, no, I, no, I take that back. I did order one small tray from uh, Bella art Jay Nicole before, but it was like a tiny tray, right? And so I've never had a bigger tray of theirs. And I was really surprised at how light it is. You know, sometimes you get trays and they're, they're a little bit heavier, you know, not like in a bad way. Uh, but I picked these up and I was like, what the heck? Like, I felt like I was lifting nothing at all. So I keep picking it up and then I'm just like, oh, like I'm almost overcompensating and it's comical how, how I'm picking it up because I'm expecting it to be a lot heavier than it is. And my label placement is atrocious today. I don't care, it's fine. I had to go to Costco today, so I'm mentally scarred from that. It was so busy. I swear, our Costco used to be like, dead in the mornings, right? Like they don't open till 10, I think it is. And before uh, the virus that we shall not name, uh, it was never very busy on the weekdays. And after that virus hit, suddenly, you know, like our, all of our local stores were, you know, just inundated and it was hard to tell if it was a factor of just, you know, like, cause remember when they couldn't let people, a certain amount of people in the building at once. So you had to wait in line and they had to let people in as other people were leaving. Such a pain in the butt. Okay. I do have the S word now. Um, and so I feel like our, our Costco got super busy after that. And then it never not got busy ever again. It's just, it's been busy since that happened. And it makes me sad because the mornings is when I used to go to Costco because, you know, nobody was there. It was great. But now I go and it's just like people everywhere. It's disgusting. And if you come to my local Costco, I'm sorry if I'm offending you, but it's just, I'm fine. It's like, there's a bunch of people, but it's when, you know, people are Instacarting and they're practically running other people over to, to get their carts full so they can you know, get it delivered and get their tips and, and whatever else. I don't even fully understand it. So I could be wrong. Um, but then it's like, I swear the local, um, what do you call it? I don't want to say the old folks home, but I can't think of the nice way. The retirement home. Thank you. <laughs> I love old people guys. I really do. Um, the local retirement homes will, you know, bring a, you know, like a shuttle bus full of people and a lot of, you know, the people, they can't walk fast, which totally get. When I get old, I'm going to be shuffling. Um, but then it's like, they're kind of like walking slow and they're almost getting run over. And so then I am feel like I need to protect 
the elderly because I don't need an Instacart person running over the sweet little old man who's just, you know, trying to, to buy his candy and whatnot. So, yeah, it's just, ugh, I don't like it. I don't like it. I miss the days when I would just go to Costco and meander and I wouldn't have to worry about getting run over. Because there are some impatient people. Who? Who doggies? I just, I try to stay out of their way because I figure, you know, I don't know what's going on in their life. So, you know, maybe this is the only time during the day that they can do all their grocery shopping. So they're in a really big hurry. Maybe. Or, you know, maybe they have a babysitter at home that's watching the kids. And so they got to get back like super quick because, you know, maybe their kid's sick or something. So I try to stay out of people's ways if they look like they're in a hurry or impatient or, you know, they just kind of look like they're a jerk. I try to stay out of the way. All right, we have one little row. Look at that. What that look like? On the camera, that looks like a bag of dirty Kleenex. They're dryer sheets, okay? Promise you, they're dryer sheets. They're not dirty Kleenexes. I'm not that old yet where I took the, the Kleenexes into my sleeve. <laughs> my grandma used to do that and then I would like pick up something of hers and like a dirty Kleenex would fall out of the sleeve and I would just be like, oh God, gross. <laughs> Like, I don't know what you wiped with that. So can you just, I don't want to touch it. Or she would get in my car and then I would find Kleenexes all over the, the floor, tucked on the side of the, the seat. Okay, that has definitely has some, some static. Okay, we're just going to put that in there before it gets too crazy. I do have static guard. I've never actually used it because I never remember to grab it when I'm doing this. I don't really like the idea of the static guard either. Like something about, you know, when a weird chemical that you spray in an aerosol format and it goes all over like the area where we technically eat. I don't know, it doesn't really sound like a, like a fun time to me, but if I need to use it, I will. Okay, I did, okay, I did put the sticker on that one. Thank goodness. Somebody's paying attention. Let's see. Okay, that was my little pile of things that I... Mm, I don't know if that one will fit. I'm going to put you to the side. Because I don't think you'll fit in a bigger or a little one. 53 is 38 to 40. Let's put that on there. Um, so I do have some Pippi the Crafty Peep stickers left. If you have not got one and you are interested in one there's a google google doc down in the description box and you can fill it out i can send you one because once these ones are gone i don't think i will be ordering more on to bigger and better stickers if you will that one I don't know. Some of these I am questioning if they will fit. That one has a little bit of static, I think. Oh, maybe not. Sometimes they just stick a little bit and then they come right out. I need a scientist to, to decipher and give me the exact reason why some of my diamonds have static and some don't. Because I've heard so many different things. Like, it's the weather. It's... <gasps> Dumb. Okay, hang on. Once again. Was that number two? Okay. Okay, which one do we think it is? 21? Do I have 21 done already? M733. M... Nope. Okay. Oh my gosh. Seriously. Pay attention. Poor munchy pudding trashy catty man. He has been opened up several times on camera today. I feel kind of bad. 
exposing his private areas. Okay, 43. Let's get the sticker. <laughs> 3721. Okay, here we go. Put that one there. Yes, somebody, somebody who's sciency, let me know how, why we have static. And I want like an official reason. I don't want like speculation, right? None of this speculation. I don't got time for that. I do enough speculating all on my own. Okay, there's one left in there. Come on, little friend. Um... The Bella Art Diamond Kit that I'm working on, there are a few colors where, I swear, there were less than 100 drills in the package. <laughs> and I'm looking at the canvas and I'm like, that doesn't seem, you know, I don't know. It makes me a little nervous when there's not many drills because I drop things and I spill. So when there's not many to start with, it just, it makes me feel like I'm gonna, I'm gonna ruin it and <laughs> just spill them all over. Anyways, so, but I literally just got, oh, the replacement canvas for that. So I'm nowhere near finishing. I don't even have a full row done. Not even a little bit. But I am excited to use my um, Care Bear release papers that I got from Bee's Crafty Corner for this kit. So excited because you know obviously uh, and if you are interested in getting the uh, Pippi the Crafty Peep release papers from Bee's Crafty Corner I will have the information in the you know ch -ch boxy boxy box below um, about how to do that so you just have to click on the custom order link and order the paper style. She's gonna have holographic paper soon. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Um, like if you want matte or glossy or holographic when the holographic ones are on there. Um, how many you want, like if you want a set of 12, uh, 24, uh, something, you know, however many, it's all listed. And then if you want them numbered, and then what sizes you want. So there's lots of different options because some people like, some people like really big release paper sections and other people, you know, like smaller areas. Uh, so I like that you can kind of pick and choose. And so you would just do the custom order and then in the note section or, you know, send her a message afterwards and just say you want the Pippi release papers and she has them saved. And so she can print them up for you. And I would recommend getting a second set of release papers. Maybe the Care Bear ones. Jill Sam. Um, because I really like them. I personally like the glossy better than the matte. I feel like they're a little bit thicker, which I like thicker release paper. And I feel like the colors are a little bit more vibrant because it's probably just, you know, the paper style, obviously. That's just me. And they're not like blindingly glossy. Because if they were blindingly glossy, then I might be like, nah, I don't know about that. Number 40. Where we go? 3033. So those, that is how you can get your hands on your own Pippi the Crafty Peep release papers. I hope this one fits. I feel like it's pushing it. Come on. Go on. There you go. And I don't know if you probably can't see on this tray, but the spout area, mm, nope, nope. I am just massacring this. Uh, it goes up, like up a little bit towards the end. So they don't just fly out if you're like trying to shake them back and forth which I never noticed before on other trays that they're just, you know, they're all just flat, which, you know, is fine, but I kind of like that feature. 48. 48 is 3799. 
$3.799 check mark. Put you right there, little friend. That one had a really long end on that end. It's fine. It's all my cutting skills. Or lack of cutting skills, I should say. Oh, okay. Well, you know what? Fine. Just just go into the tray. Whatever. I don't care. Go in. There you go. Okay. Fold on the side. Um, okay. This number 22 is probably fit in a little one and then I do have a whole huh, tray of mixed sizes so 22 was 738 738 738 oh my goodness Ooh. okay that was just rude. But, whoa, that one hopped. He's part rabbit. Oh, there we go. You go back in there. Okay, I need a quick drink of my Dr. Pepper before it goes warm because a warm Dr. Pepper is a sad Dr. Pepper. I remember watching that movie. It was sweet. What am I doing? Put the sticker on dinghy. Um, Blast from the past. It had Brendan Fraser and Alicia Silverstone in it. And it was the one where he was like a baby and or he was born in a fallout shelter. His dad was like a crazy scientist and so they all lived underground for like 30 years or something. And so then he came up to, you know, the real world and it's, it wasn't, you know, a nuclear holocaust like they thought it was going to be. Um, but I remember the dad, the dad liked to drink hot Dr. Pepper. Like they were saying, I remember there was like a scene or something and they were like, he likes to, he likes to drink his Dr. Pepper hot. And so the, the wife would warm it up on the stove for him. I remember thinking, oh, that's weird, but I've never done it. Maybe I should try. I don't know. I don't really want to waste a Dr. Pepper like that though, because things are expensive now, man. Things are crazy expensive. And even if I buy my, you know, my soda on sale, which I refuse to pay full price, seriously, why would you pay full price? Don't do it guys, don't do it, it's a trap. Um, but still, even then, it's not cheap. Okay, where are we next? Do, do, do. Um, I think 57 would fit. Oops, well, you know what? Just go over there. 57 is, oh, this is, oh, this is one of the uh, Soul Dust. So pretty. I you can't, it's hard because it doesn't really, it doesn't really do it justice. But look at those flat bottoms. Oh, those are flatter than my butt. My butt is flat. So you may not wanted to know that. <laughs> now you do. <laughs> but when you're talking diamonds, the flatter the butt, the better. Okay, is this? Okay, maybe I'm going to put a little... A little bit of dryer sheet. Okay, why do I have such big sheets in here? This was supposed to be just my little little pieces. And it's making a mess. I don't even know what time it is, guys. Uh, it's one. Okay. Let's pour those in there. Maybe that will calm those ones that are already in there down a little bit. Hopefully. I did have, which kit was it? I can't remember what kit it was. I think it was the Diamond Painting Fanatics kit. And I don't know if it was the weather or what, but I was working on it and all of a sudden, diamonds that hadn't had static, you know, after I had kitted them up and they calmed down and all that, 
I had diamonds that had static and I'm like, what the heck is going on? This is some Hocus Pocus witchcraft voodoo because normally once you, the, you know, once you unstatic them a little bit, they, they don't, they don't do it anymore. So it was very confusing and I am easily confused sometimes, but it was really confusing because I poured them out in the tray and they just everywhere. It's very like, what the heck is going on? Oh, you came out beautifully, number 51. Thank you for that. My gosh, that's how they all need to be. Okay, get all those little bags in there. Uh, I think number six could probably fit in a little one. Ooh, there are some. This is a party going on in this bag. Look at that. Look at all of those party people hanging out in the, the diamonds. Okay, so this one is number six, and that is 335. That's one reason why you leave the, the first number sticker on. Don't be like me. It's okay, though. It just takes me longer, and I struggle more. Okay. This one is like a confetti sprinkle party. Oh my gosh. That is really full. I really hope I don't have to I don't have to move that to a bigger one. That was one thing. They always get stuck in the little finger nubbin right there. Okay, let's try to tap them down. And there's only a few more. So if you all could just go in there, that'd be great. And then, of course, when I go to use these for the first time, I'll forget how full it is, and I will spill them everywhere. That's what I do. Okay, that little one, that's, that one probably can do it. Maybe that one. That one, no. Maybe. Yeah, no, 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 maybe. Mm, maybe no mm, maybe Shh. hey oh, I swear these cats are giving me gray hairs it's scratching we have a wooden bench by the front door and he's over there scratching it and I don't I don't understand why, because it's not like we don't have a gajillion scratching posts everywhere, you know, to encourage scratching on those items. But they don't scratch our furniture. Like, they, they scratch the wood. They scratch the closet doors. And that's it. They don't scratch the couch, the leather chair. They did ruin my dining room chairs, but that wasn't from purposeful scratching that was just from them jumping on the chairs and sinking their tiny evil claws into the you know pleather chairs yeah so now we have chair covers <laughs> that now have holes in them because again their little tiny claws have punctured the holes Go in there. There's that. There's. 31 is number 928. 928. 928. 928. I like that they almost go through the whole alphabet in this. There are a few that you know, that are like symbols instead of the alphabet. But I liked how it went like numbers and then alphabet in order with, you know, some symbols in for the, you know, the tricky, the tricky letters that you might get confused about. And then of course I just do this all completely randomly. So 
any any help that it would have been to have them in order is pretty much gone, but that's okay. 39. 989. Whoa. There we go. find out. Oh, I gotta go into my new, my other tray of, of small ones. Number 50 is 3822. 3822. Let's do this. Here we go. I, <laughs> last two days, actually, last two, well, I guess we should say early mornings, I have had to come downstairs because I've heard questionable noises happening downstairs. So two days ago, it was mm, 3 a.m. and I heard crinkling. Now, if you have cats and you have plastic, then you can kind of, you know, understand when a certain sound is being heard you can probably go mm, yeah the cats are playing with something they shouldn't be playing with so I heard that sound and I really didn't want to get out of bed but I also didn't know what he had so I got up and the one cat was sitting at the bottom of the stairs and almost killed me he was kitty land mining uh, and I don't know, maybe his brother bribed him to sit there. So, you know, I, he would delay me from catching him being naughty. I don't know. And then I went into the like kitchen cause that's right off the stairs. And the cat had gone into my purse and pulled out, um, a plastic, like a, basically a plastic bag. So Whenever I go to urgent care or the hospital or somewhere where they have those, those plastic lined, like the circle opening with like the kind of long plastic bag that, you know, they want you to use in case you get sick. So you can just, they can just throw, you know, the bag of puke or whatever out. I always take one or two of those just because, you know, they're good to have in the car and, you know, have in your purse in case of emergency. Uh, so I had grabbed one of those at the hospital and yeah, the cat had gone into my bag. Like, and this thing was shoved down. It was not, you know, just resting on the top. No, no, no. So the cat had gone into my purse and dug around in my purse because there were other things pulled out of my purse. And he pulled out that plastic puke bag and had just, torn it to shreds like there were teeth marks all over it now they're chasing each other and like it was just covered in you know cat saliva and I'm like what are you doing and he was not happy that I took that from him he like swiped at my leg and I'm like you better watch yourself cat because you could be a, a temporary visitor in this family if you're gonna attack any of us so <laughs> uh, so I took his his toy from him and I I chucked it in the office and our office is not like a grand office it's literally like the size of a I don't know I guess like a bathroom that you would find downstairs you know somebody's house where guests go it's not very big but you know it's where we put things that we don't want the cats to get because we have to close the door because cats are jerks <laughs> um and he I swear he tried to squeeze past me to go and get the bag because I just threw it in there and he almost got trapped in the office because he was trying to squeeze past me to get to the bag that I was throwing in there and I was like no 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 
So I also grabbed my purse because I didn't know if there was anything else in my purse and I didn't really want to sit there and, you know, dig around and find out at 3 a.m. Not really, you know, what I want to be doing at 3 a.m. I want to be in my bed. Uh, so I grabbed my purse and I threw it in there and he like went at my leg. Like he thought, I don't know, did he really think that I was going to stop and go, oh, I'm sorry. Did you want that? Let me give that to you. No. So then the next night, well, no, not night. I shouldn't say night because it was early morning. I got up at the usual time and I came downstairs in the kitchen to, no, 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 no. Oh God, he likes paper. Nope. Um, at the normal time to, you know, start making breakfast and all that jazz. And there was a plastic bag on the floor. And I'm like, what the heck is this? Well, I had gone to the dentist. And when you go to the dentist, they, whoa, those are staticky. Okay, excuse, no, no, no. He's trying to violate poor munchy pudding trashy catty, seriously. He had gone into my purse again, and I didn't even remember this was in there, but they had given me a plastic bag with some floss because we don't need toothbrushes. We got toothbrushes coming out our, you know, what's. Um, so they had just given me the bag with some of the floss and I totally forgot about it. Well, seemingly the cat helped himself to my purse again. So half the contents are knocked out on the floor and he was chewing holes in the plastic bag. So I don't know, man, he's got like a sixth sense for plastic and he is literally chewing on a piece of plastic that is on my table right here. Can you hear it? Yeah. I didn't pick it up because it was in the it was in this box with the Elizabeth Ward trays. Um, no, don't eat. Oh, you're such. Oh, seriously, hold on. Cat slobber and bite marks. Oh. Why is nothing easy today? <laughs> no, that's no. Mm. Oh, okay. Animals are so fun. They're so fun. Okay. No. Okay. Now I'm just going to crinkle every time I move. So fan freaking tastic. I just want to kit this up because I literally want to put some time and sound on it. X, X, X. Okay, where are all my stickers? Where are they? Come on. Okay, there we go. Focus, people. We're going to be here all dang day. Because I still got these big old ones. Eek. Of course, the first ones didn't have static. And now, you know. Now they do. Thanks, static. Nope, that was sticking to my hand. Go in there. Did, okay, good. Huh. Did I put the sticker on? Yes, I did. Okay. Now my cats are bumping the camera mount. Thanks, guys. Okay, this. And now we're going to get into the portion of the, the kitting up where I question every single bag of drills. Okay, this is number 17. I am not going to put the sticker on because I am not convinced that it is all going to fit in there. I don't know. That's not going to fit. So now we go to the bigger containers and this is where we make a mess. I always feel like I'm spanking the tray when I tap its butt, like tap, tap, tap. Okay, number 17 is H. Heck yeah, number eight. Where's H? Come on, H. Here you go. Here you go. Here you go. Oh, whoa. 
seemingly I was a little too aggressive with my trying to take that label off. Okay, next. Number four. I'm going to say that as static, so I'm going to say that one is not going to go go in nicely. So we're just going to go for a bigger tray. Or a bigger, not tray. You know what I mean, guys. You know what I mean. That is, that one is extra staticky. Ooh, doggies. Number four is sticker four. Love that. Love that. Love it when that happens. All right. Whoa. Oh my, those are the sticky. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. Let's. Whoa. Let's put a bigger piece in this one just to calm some of that down. Maybe. Right in there. And sometimes it's just easier than to just dump it in the tray. There you go, number four. Number 18. Again, I am gonna say you need a bigger one. And number 18 is J. Where's J? J, you are right here. Right. There's, that one doesn't look staticky, maybe. Nope, that one was beautiful. Ugh, they all could just be like that. Would you pay more if they could guarantee that your diamonds weren't staticky? I don't know if I would or not. It would depend on how much more. Oh, get off. Okay, I don't know why I tried to put this in the small one. I got so excited about thinking about paying more for non-staticky diamonds that I just can't control myself. Uh, okay. Put in there. Let's put a little piece of dryer in. Oh, well, hey, I spilled it in the tray, guys. I spilled it in the tray. So it doesn't count as a spill because it was in the tray. Okay, there's that. Okay, let's see if we can pour that in there, kind of. And I did not put the sticker on this one yet, so let's make sure we put it on. Although I hopefully I would figure it out if there's just no, you know, sticker left. Okay, where is, this was number two. Oh, so it's number two. Number two, two. There's that. Number 11. I'm... Ugh, see, some of these, I'm like, maybe they could fit. Just don't know. Oh, yeah, no. That one definitely needs to be in that one. Good call. Good job, me. You're welcome. And I just would also, wow, this just, <laughs> this just popped into my head. That's literally my life, guys. This, this just popped into my head. But, if that's my cat, <laughs> interrupting as always, um, if you send me a private message, like on Facebook or, or Instagram or TikTok or, or something, um, and I don't respond, it's because a lot of times I don't have notifications turned on because I get a little anxious when like things are constantly, you know, lighting up and, and telling me that there's things that I need to like look at. So if you've left me a message and I haven't responded within a day, try again or the best, best way to do it would be to leave me a YouTube comment and be like, I sent you a message. <laughs> I'm good with email. And I'm pretty good with YouTube comments, but if it's like a if it's like a, a Facebook message or something, I, it just yeah. 
it just like I have because I have two different accounts on Facebook and Instagram so then sometimes it'll get logged into one and it won't get logged into the other and then again if I don't have notifications on and I don't look at it um, or sometimes it just it doesn't tell me that there's like a pending message or something like that so yeah oh geez and crackers so I'm not trying to be rude by any means um because yeah I noticed there were messages that were like two weeks old and I was like oh geez I'm sorry <laughs> okay this is that is not gonna fit in that one. Oh my goodness we're already graduating in size oh that was really stupid wow see I'm trying to rush now because I'm like, I'm running out of time. I'm running out of time. So, because I really don't want to to break this into two videos. Because, again, I'm lazy and I don't want to do that. Okay, and what? Oh my gosh, was this 46? I hope it was 46. It was either 46 or 4. We'll see. Okay, we need some dryer sheet in this stat. All right, just, there we go. It's fine. It's fine. 46. 3768. 3768. Did I do that one yet? I feel like I touched it. I really do. 3768. I did not. So it's fine. My mind. My mind is already going. Okay. Go in there, please, friends. Let's. Whoa. That was a little aggressive. I'm sorry. Okay, go in there. Come on. They're sticking to the tray right at the entrance. I need you to go down the hole. Go down the hole. Please go down the hole. Okay. Collect the ones that are trying to escape. You don't get to escape. Sorry. But no. Should I get them all? I think so. Okay. Well, I have just made a mess today. This one I feel like could maybe be in the middle size. I'm hoping I don't need to use any of the extra, extra large ones, but I do have, I do have like six of the really big ones. So if I have to, I have to. myself too. Pay attention to the sizes that fit when you're putting them in so you can look at the other ones and gauge if it will fit or not. Do I remember to do that? No. That would require effort and memory. Okay, that was, was that number 10? See, I have all these bags around. Was that number 10? Number 10. Was that A? A. I it was was that four one three really? Number ten is A. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, I am a laugh riot. Number seven is three four one. That. No, I'm not even gonna try that. <laughs> have lots. I have lots. And if I need to use two small containers, I can use two small containers for something. I think some people might use like a small container if they have like a really, really big chunky bag and then put the extras in, you know, like a Ziploc or, or maybe the big container, but then just don't put them in the tray. That could be something to do. I can't leave them in the Ziploc bags though, because that exact freaking reason right there. Hey, could you please get out of my cat? Cat, out of the cat, please. Okay, where is number seven? Oh my gosh. The chaos is making me a little anxious right now. I need you. Um, personal space. Personal space. Thank you. Goodbye. Thank you. Goodbye. That doesn't mean come around the other direction. Nope, it doesn't actually. 
49. Holy static cling care bears. <laughs> oh my gosh, that is some sticky. So he's just casually sitting here, right? Licking his paw, but he's also looking at that tray stopper that he already tried to eat. I see what he's doing. Okay, well, let's just pour it directly in the tray. I see what he's doing. He's just going to lay there and act like he's not plotting to steal my tray stopper. Now granted, I don't really use tray stoppers a lot. Every once in a while I might, but I really don't. But that doesn't mean I want my cat to steal it and ruin it. See, 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 told you. He's trying to act all innocent, but he's shifty. Okay, come on, go down. Oh. Hopefully all the static means that the drills are gonna, seriously, get in there. You're gonna be amazing. Three, this is 49, 49, 3805, 3805. There's like, well, those are so staticky in there. Oh my gosh. Okay, then let's put ones we've already done away. Okay, that one's pretty big. We're gonna try this one. I don't know if it's gonna work, but we're gonna try. Cause again, I can't gauge if it's gonna fit or not. Okay. What time? What time we got? What time we got? I gotta make sure I can go pick up people from school. It's frowned upon when you're there late. Oh. I am going to say that these are not going to fit in that. Nope. Because the second I open this to, to use them, they are going to go everywhere. I should have known that. But I, I didn't. I didn't listen to my instincts, guys. You should listen to your instincts. Go oh, down there. Okay. And another thing, if you don't know, these lids actually come off. I forget that they come off. <laughs> Way too often I forget that they actually come off. But that doesn't mean that I'm not going to spill them still. Because I am consistently inconsistent. Okay, there's that. You go in there. There's already a dryer sheet in this one. But it is crazy how I started this and there was no static. And now all of a sudden, static everywhere. It did start raining. Again, I don't know if that had something to do with it. But it is rather moist outside now. All right, we have those and all these dryer. Why did I dump those out? Jeez, I was just being dramatic, but now my drama has caused me more work later to clean up. So I don't know if it was worth it. Seriously, I don't know what these cats are ingesting that makes them so weird. Well, Sharky's probably all the plastic that he's chewed up from my purse the last two days, but... What's your excuse, Duncan? Huh? 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 25. 25 is R. R. You... Tired of being annoying, Duncan? Nope, he's not. He said it. 
Okay, that one can probably go in this little. Let's put some dryer sheetage. Yeah, our weather is, I feel like I have drills down my sleeve. Hang on. No, it's just weirdly cold down the random spot of my sleeve. Cool. Our weather has been so weird because it's kind of been warmer, kind of. So then we turned the heat down, but now it's raining and it's cold and the air that's coming out of the vents is a little chilly. And I'm always cold, so I'm always like, no, always, always heat, please. Except for when it, you know, gets past 80, then it's just turn the air conditioning on because I am dying of heat stroke. I do not like to be hot. I am not one of those hot weather people. I am pale and cold all the time. But then when it's hot, I, I have to stay inside <laughs> because... I sunburn really easy, guys. My skin gets this color. Oh dear. And now I have help. Well, not help. He's not gonna help me, but he wouldn't know what to do with the static guys. Oh my gosh. Wait. I already did 46. I swear I already did 46. Oh, there's two bags of this. Mmm. Okay, I'm gonna put that to the side. <laughs> That's the only one that there's two bags of. I remember seeing that when I opened it and then I instantly forgot it because, you know, that's what I do. So we have number 19. Let's put, let's put a bigger dryer sheet in this one because I have a feeling it's not gonna do much it can't touch all the, all the diamonds. If you could fit in there, that would be so great, friend. Oh, okay. Nope, nope. You're gonna be like that, I see. It's fine. Okay. looks like it's like six o'clock outside but it's like 1 30 because it's so overcast okay that's number 19 don't forget that it's number 19. somebody remind me it's number 19 if i forget it oh nope oh ow number 19. 19 is k okay. oh I don't like it when the, the first, oh dear, I dropped all those plastic sheets onto the floor. That's not good. Hopefully the cat did not hear that. 32. Okay, 32. Let's see. Let's just go for this size. I just need it to fit and be done. That's what I need it to be done. So I'm going to put you in. Oh. Goodness, you're a big boy. Doot, doot, doot. Okay, there's that. Put a littler one in. Nope, didn't make it in. Second try. Shove that back down in there. Give it a little shaky shake. realized I have laundry that needs to be washed. Why would I remember that when I, you know, I'm not in the middle of something that's also requiring me to pay attention. Okay. Oh, there's some, there's a yellow in there. He's just going in. It's his party. 32. 32 is this backwards Z. Oh, just cover up that other dirty spot on the container? No one will know. That one I think can fit in here, maybe. Ugh. There's that. 
give it a shake a shake a shake like hot potato with that hopefully it doesn't spill all over that would be bad put that in there take that oh my gosh it's so full but i think i think it's gonna fit i think i can make it fit I'm hoping. He's literally talking on the phone and it is so loud. Does he not understand the important things that are going on in here? Clearly not. Clearly not. What is the point of them making him take days off so he can use up his sick pay if they're just going to call? That is what I want to know. But I don't have a job, so maybe I don't know what's going on. Okay, go in there. Go in there. This is number 23. Oh my gosh. I don't know why I think that this is only going to take like 15 minutes when I sit down to do it very optimistic like blindly optimistic you could say oh geez okay they are those ones are going all over the stinking place come on there friends just work with me and i will also i will keep the red oh i should i should put the sticker for the round ones or for the well, for the ones that I got in round, I should put the sticker on a container so I don't lose the sticker. Because it seems like something I might do. Come on. Get out of there. Okay. This was number 23. Going to our list. 744. Oh, hey, look. The sticker pieces. Oh, my gosh. I'm ripping it that over there that one is done okay we only have four more colors and I have been sitting on my feet they are completely asleep and I'm honestly scared to move them at this point so we will just continue sitting on our feet which I know I shouldn't do but I do it ow don't break the nails don't break the fingernails today. I don't have time to fix them. Okay, that was number 54. Don't forget that. Don't forget it. They're going all over. It's fine. It's fine. 54 is that one, that one. Okay. Okay, we're getting close. Oh my gosh. Getting close. Oh, you off the phone? I think you now. Uh, okay, I Very don't know. Important things. important things. I cannot believe you would say that you have more important things than I'm me right now. If I give them vacation, that is important. Yes, vacation time is important. Okay, which. Let's try this one. So, oh, look around. Wow. It's been a while since these got used. Holy moly. Okay. 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 H94. Okay. We are so, so close, so close. Then I have to clean up my mess so the cats don't eat any of this stuff. 27. Okay, that one might need a bigger one. And then I gotta figure out the 46 situation. I probably just put the other bits, fine. Fine, don't come off then. The other pieces in a smaller container, just cause. I don't know if I have enough room in my tray. I might. If I don't have enough room in my tray when I have extra diamonds, 
then I put them in my my kind of like my my desk area where I diamond paint. I have some pull out drawers that I have lids on so cats can't access them. Okay, there we go. Oh, yep. Just getting even sloppier and sloppier as the day goes on. That's fine. Get out of there. Uh, 27. That is T. Oh, it's 819. I love 819. Nice pale pink. That's going to look great in Cheer Bear's cheeks and things. That is not going to fit. Nope. 58. And this is one of the other Soldest drills. Nice yellow. This is going to be on the, like, in some of the stars and the, the little background glimmer from the uh, behind the stars. Okay focus. Um, there we go. That is, is that, oh my gosh, that's technically the last of those, but I need to put these in. Let's put them in one of these. I got extras. Do that. Oh my god, they're so messy. Why are they so staticky? So rude. <sighs> they are really sticky in this last bag. Of course they are. Why wouldn't they be sticky? Oh my gosh, it's been an hour and like 16 minutes. Yeesh. If you're still here, let me know. Give me a give me a colorful emoji. <laughs> goes. I'm pretty sure some of you have punched out of this yawn factory by now. Whoa. Okay. This is three seven six eight. So that's an extra. So we're just gonna put you right there. We got those. Let's push that aside. We might as well organize them while we're here together. Ugh, stupid plastic bag in my lap. Okay. All right. So, do, do, do. I am going to pull. I will clean up the rest of this off camera because nobody wants to watch that. But I'm going to pull out all the numbers over here, put the letters over here. And then symbols and other miscellaneouses will go over there. Because I don't know exactly what kind of symbols they use because I've never done a canvas from Art and Soul. Uh, so everybody has their own kind of like symbols that they use like some people really are heavy on the dots others are on the you know dreaded corner triangles and then you know some companies like to do arrows in every color in every direction known to mankind uh, so until I oh this one doesn't have a sticker why do you not have a sticker did I forget a sticker Noogle boo. It's not good. Okay. Did I lose a sticker? Is the question. No. Oh, I bet that's 150. Well, we're going to go with that's 152 because 152 is pink. And that is a pink. See? Always check your area. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Those are, those are symbols. Those are symbols i'm gonna say even though that's not a z it looks like a z to me that's here we go that's a letter that's a letter that kind of looks like a backward or a sideways m so i'm gonna put that with letters as well that's 
a number. These are symbols, letter, letter, letter. Okay, here we go. So, oh my God. Okay, there's that. All right. Oh, let's make a mess. Perfect. Okay. Nope. Nope. There we go. Okay, so I start at the bottom. Can't see it, but it's. I promise it's at the bottom. So then I do one, two. Oh, spilling. Yep. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Then we start with the letters. So we have A. We did not have, I'm looking at this, there was not a B, but there was a C. So we have C, and then we have D. Yep, D, E, F. There's, those are symbols. G, come on G, was there a G? Oh no, it's some weird circle thing that's kind of like a backwards G. I don't think of that as a G, so I'm not putting that with G. You might think of it as a G, but I do not, I see weird circle squiggle when I see that. Then we have K, we have L, M, do we have an N in here? Yes, we do. N, O, P, there is no Q, but there is an R, and is there an S? No, there's no S, but there is T. U. Is there a V? Yes, there is. It's right in front of me. And then X, Y. Oh, crap. Well, see, this what happens you don't pay attention. So I was looking at that. Let's see, that's an H. Even though it's a lowercase H, I still think of it as, oh, well, see, look, I'm even more screwed up now. Okay. Mm, that is just how today is going to go. Come on, it's fine guys, it's fine. Cause A, little A, needs to go after big A. Then we have C, D, E, F, G, H, H. And we have K, L, M, N is not gonna fit. And then I actually kind of think this looks like sideways M. So I'm gonna put that after big M for little M. Little N, N, N. Then we have O, P, R, T, and then we have, I think of the plus sign as a T, and then lowercase t, and then we have U, we have V, X, Y, and then we have Z, but it's backwards Z, but it's Z to me. And then we have, let's move this, okay, now, hmm. Let's see what kind of symbols we have. This is a double decker, but I will just probably put the, the refills towards the end of the pot. So sometimes I do lines or dots, depending on how many lines or dots there are. And then other times I will just organize these by color. And I am going to go by color. So I will start with the symbol color that looks red, okay? Because sometimes the symbol color and the color of the drills are not the same. So I will start with red and then I will go to pink. So we have pink, pink, equal sign is pink. And then we have lighter pink down here. Lighter pink, lighter pink. And then we will go into oranges, peach orange, orange. That's kind of yellowy orange. That's yellow, yellow. We have green. The star is a green. This one is more gray, so we're gonna leave that for grays. Then we do blues. So we have blue, 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 blue. Mm, blue. And extra. 
and then those two. Okay. All right. That I think is as good as it's going to get. And then when this one is empty or when this one is empty, then I will just, you know, switch off the things and move it to there. And I also normally keep a little trash, trash drill container. So we will, let's see, could we go? Oh no, no, I don't want to move those around. I'll just put trash drill right there. So that is it. Oh my gosh, that was like an hour and a half. I'm sorry. <laughs> Again, if you're still here, thank you. Obviously, if you have made it to the end, you should consider liking and subscribing because if you've made it this far, then you may like all of my videos because uh, none of them are organized. All of them are chaotic uh, and I'm usually a mess. So this is Cheer Bear with Stars, Art and Soul Diamonds. I cannot wait to test this out and let you guys know what I think. So until next time, big awkward hugs. Bye guys.